All right. Bloody ready, mate. Let's bloody do this show for these mates, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Oops, <laughs> found one of our old poppers, huh? It must have been one of the ones that missed the other day. Yeah. All right, are you ready? Yeah. Hello, wonderful world of YouTube. This is Motivated Living Daddy Daughter Fragrance Review, bond number nine, the scent of peace for women. Bum, bum, bum. We thank you for coming back and seeing us, and if this is your first time, we thank you for dropping by. We invite you to stay. It's warm and cozy here. We have a lot of fun. We try to uh, bring you real talk about fragrances, what we think about it. Uh, this is a women's fragrance. This is something new that I'm doing. Uh, we just did one uh, with the two Katy Perrys, and now we're going to do um, this fragrance, The Scent of Peace, Bond number 9. And I love the way it comes the presentation, they call it. It's pretty cool. And I'm gonna set this over here. Uh, this one came out in 2006, uh, from what I found at least, but we're just now getting it in the house. Uh, crazy story, I actually won this fragrance, um, Max Aroma, for my wife, and she has been loving it. And it mm -hmm. smells really good on her too. Yeah. Yeah, you like it too? Yeah. So let's go ahead, I'm gonna open this bad boy up. But, uh, I'm just now getting familiar with the Bond fragrances, um, and you're probably going to see quite a bit more because I've been liking what I've been seeing and, and all that good stuff. You're so cute. <laughs> oh, and she says precious. This is my daughter, Princess Kylie. For all y'all who don't know, my name is Chris, and again, you're tuned in to Motivated Living. So hang tight. We're going to dive into this scent of peas. All right, let's go ahead and crack this thing open. Yeah, it's really, really neat the way they put that all together. Uh, there's more that came with it. I believe she has it in the bedroom. It has like a little map in there. And, Cause I don't see it in the box. She took it out and I don't think it made it back into here yet. I'm gonna look though. Nope, she still got it in the back. But uh, it was really neat. Like, oh cool, bonus. Um, I'll go ahead, I'm gonna show you the bottle. Uh, looks like a star, you know, and oh, quit. Yeah, I'm not gonna drop it. You see the dove uh, symbolizing peace. Now, from what I read on this scent, um, it came, it was released after the tragic events mm -hmm. on 9/11, and uh, this came out after came out after all that. And the notes I actually wrote was, "It's the dove taking flight." The, of course, the symbol of peace and how it did, again, come after the 9-11 attacks. Uh, it says the main idea is that the peace of each city, even New York, comes out of worldwide peace. And this one was created in memory uh, of all the victims in 9-11, whether they were killed or injured in the attacks on the World Trade Center. Uh, and then I also went on farther to read that bond number nine, the company for every bottle of this sold donated two dollars out of each sale to unicef so to help others which was actually i thought was pretty cool i like that so i've read good and bad on it um where you know some people you know you're always going to have uh haters for lack of better words let me see a wrist i'm gonna pop some of this on there so we can sniffy as we go Ooh, see how that came out pretty good yeah it's actually really pretty, like a pretty scent, you know. It's really strong at first. Mm, strong at first. Yeah, yeah it is strong. Um, it's that's windows. cool. I've never really looked at it. It's a Eau de Parfum. Of course, that's oh, 100 mil, 3.3. I'm looking at the, it even has like a serial number mm -hmm. stamped on it. And I really like how they did the bottle. It's neat. That's the first bomb fragrance in the house. Now, I have sent a piece for him coming here soon, too. Um, just because I got all pumped, like I want some. Uh, but yeah, Max Aroma, I don't know if you're familiar with the company. Again, Max, M-A-X, Aroma is one word. Um, they gave a giveaway contest thingy and 
-hmm. I went ahead and did a comment, liked and all that stuff. And next thing I know, I get a email requesting my address, tell me I had won it. Like, I usually don't ever win anything. So, <laughs> they, uh, I mean, I won these guys, you know, my family. And, but uh, winning. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and let me smell where I sprayed you at. Which one was it? It's fresh, like almost soapy fresh at first mm. to me, like right yeah. out of the shower, almost like, yeah, like a shower gel, really high quality shampoo smell almost. Uh, mm. Let me see that again. That is the vibe I'm almost like, getting, like just real, like an expensive shower. It this way? <laughs> it's like a star. Yeah, like, um, like, 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 she already used it. Yeah, she already used a little bit. Yeah, she has used it. Like well, she it. likes it a lot. See, I think this came Thursday so. for her. Uh, I'm going to move on. I, I wrote down, well, it says it was made by a Michelle Elmerick was the perfumer behind that. Um, the men's fragrance was released in 2013. The, this one came out in 2006. Uh, the top notes are said to be grapefruit, black currant, and I also read somewhere else that blackberry is in the top notes. And I don't know if that has something to do with the black currant, if it's a blackberry, or, um, but I'm just throwing that in there. Now, your heart notes are Lily of the Valley and Hed Hedione, H-E-D-I-O-N-E, -E, uh, with base notes of cedarwood and musk. Now, these are available in the 50 mil and the 100 mil. And of course, they're uh, Eau de Parfums. Now this one though didn't rate as good as I thought it would. Oh, it I'm like, peace. well yeah, it's called the scent of peace. Yeah, it says peace down here. She's seeing. Here, let me see if I can hold it up a little bit. So you got the dove flying, um, and then right here it's written real fancy. It says peace. Um, the men's fragrance is a blue bottle and has a black bow tie on it, which is yeah. really cool. There's, there's another fragrance review, reviewer uh, with the bow tie. And uh, I watched his review on it. And I was like, oh, that's really cool. But um, now the base notes, yeah, cedarwood and musk. I already said all that. Um, what do you think of the perfume? I really like it. You like it? It's like... Oh, I like it. I tell Mama I like it all the time when she wears I it. I smell a little bit of mint. Mint? I'm not smelling mint in there. Yeah, and I'm not seeing any type of mint at all. The the fruitiest things are would be in your top notes, which is where we should still be. It's saying grapefruit and the black currant and also the blackberry, which uh, I'm not fully sure on how that correlates. But um so it's kind of fruity. I don't yeah, like the it. open. The blackberry. It's that's why I'm smelling. Mm, could be. Blackberries are always smelling like that. I get a I almost get like a just a fresh out of the show. It's fresh, yeah. in my opinion, like really fresh, yeah. and it's pretty, you know, like yeah. for lack of better words, it just smells pretty. And now I, I've my wife since she's got it, she's like, I want to wear that one, and she has a ton, just like I do. Like we're, you know, uh, I I made a comment on one of the forums on Facebook, the groups. Somebody asked about the addiction, and I said, Yeah, I do. I you know I, I love having them and. You know, my wife at first was always saying, I can't believe why you keep buying all these. And so I kind of got her hooked by, okay, here's a bottle for you. Check this out. And now she's just as hyped as I am about them. But uh, she's been wanting to go with this one since she got it because she's really liking it. And I've seen uh, a couple unsolicited com compliments come up to her. And then she's told me of a couple as she's been out at her various doctor's appointments as well, where people have commented on them. Um, I a lasting power. She sprayed it on early in the day. Um, I don't think it's super long lasting because I don't recall smelling it on her late in the day like some of her juices. But as far as like staying power, it, it it doesn't seem like it lasts as long as some of the other Eau de Parfums. And I read a lot of people say that with some of the Bond fragrances that they tend not to last really, really, really long. But then I read some reviews where they say they last like all day. Um, but I'll still smell it on her, but it seems like it becomes a skin scent you know, rather than still projecting pretty good after several hours. Let me sniff you again, see where we're at. Man, that's really pretty. It's, it's not it's not loud and offensive at all. Um, I would feel like if you're a professional woman and you want to wear it to work or um, 
just out and about on errands. I wouldn't say this is like a bar slash club type stand if you're going out to meet people or anything like that, but it seems more of a, yes, casual to um, almost dressy type, because it's, it, it's just not an in-your-face type scent, you know, it, and it's calm, and, it, and I know when she sprays it on, I'm not smelling it like, unless she's in front of a fan, like clear across the room. Like some of the other ones she wears, like was it my Burberry Black or the Coach ones? Certain ones she sprays on, and I'll smell them the other end of the house, you know, <laughs> like they're just yeah. he man strong. And this isn't one of them, but uh, you know, from here to here, I'll smell it, and uh, you know, and she likes it. She likes going nuts with them. <laughs> She's my mama likes to spray, <laughs> and uh, and it's not knocking me out or anything. So, oh, but yeah. but it smells pretty, and it smells good. It's inviting. It's clean. Uh, Smell it on her now. I didn't really get the same vibe as when my wife was wearing it, but it says it smells like a fresh right out of the shower. I'm clean. I'm fresh yeah, type yeah. scent. Um, today. Right now, I'd say if you could find it at a good, a good price, like through the discounters or something, I'd say go for it. Did, was it a safe blind buy? I would like to say so. Um, I think that's about it. Anything you want to tell them about it? You want to sniff it again? Tell them what you think. Should they get it? Is it safe? Do they? Do you like it? I love it. Is it that's something you could wear every day? Yeah. Yeah, it is. Mama Blake, you better not. <laughs> yeah. Get your own bottle, kid. Yeah. <laughs> well, that's about it in a nutshell. Um, I don't have as much like stuff on this because I don't, you know, I'm doing women's fragrances and she's laying down. She's it's hard to get her out here, so I brought Princess Kylie. She does my male fragrance reviews with me, yeah. so I'm gonna try to mix it up for you guys, and I'll keep you know for everybody just. We'll do different reviews, and as time goes, and as more time comes, and as the channel continues to grow, I'll try to bring like outside people in to join us, where they can smell certain ones and give their reviews. You know, men, women, whatever, uh, give their how they feel about certain scents, and uh, go from there. So either way, we thank you for tuning in to Motivated Living, where change is on the horizon, pushing for a better life. Uh, we encourage you to like, share, subscribe, ring your notification bells. Um, yeah, it's all up there and please leave me some comments, man. Tell me if you're familiar with any of these scents, any, uh, if you go through any of my reviews, uh, or if there's, there's something we could be doing better. Cause I'm new to this, man. I'm just winging it for you guys. You know, I like fragrances period. Uh, and you know, some of my talks are just things to, just to bring the, to the people. So ultimately we're doing this for you guys, uh, fight and sleep to be here yeah. and, um, so give us some feedback, give us some comments, show some love, you know. Drop a comment down there. We thank you. Either way, each and every one of y'all matter. Motivated living. Have a good day. Be blessed. See you guys soon. Bravo, bravo. <laughs> Ciao.